Fuzhou is the capital and one of the largest cities in Fujian Province, People's Republic of China. Along with the many counties of Ninda, those of Fuzhou are considered to constitute the Mindong linguistic and cultural area. Fuzhou's core counties lie on the north bank of the estuary of Fujian's largest river, the Min River. All along its northern border lies Ninda, and Ningdi's Gushan County lies upriver. Fuzhou's counties south of the Min border on Pushan, Quanzhou, Sanming and Nanping prefectures. Its population was 7,115,370 inhabitants as of the 2010 census, of whom 4,408,076 inhabitants are urban representing around 61.95%. While rural population is at 2,707,294 representing around 38.05%. Etymology and Names In older publications, the name Fuzhou was variously romanized as Fu Chao, Fuao, Futsu, Fuh Chao, Hok Chu or Hot Chu. The Yuan He maps and records of prefectures and counties, a Chinese geographical treatise published in the 9th century, says that Fuzhou's name came from Mount Futo, a mountain located northwest of the city. The mountain's name was then combined with Zhou, meaning settlement or prefecture, in a manner similar to many other Chinese cities. During the Warring States period, area of Fuzhou was sometimes referred to as Yi and Fuzhou was incorporated into China proper during Qin Dynasty. The city's name was changed numerous times between the 3rd and 9th centuries before finally settling on Fuzhou in 948. In Chinese, the city is sometimes referred to by the poetic nickname Rongcheng literally, the Banyan City. History Pre-Keen history the remains of two Neolithic cultures, the Hukiatu culture, from around 5000 BC, and the Tanshi mountain culture, from around 3000 BC, have been discovered and excavated in the Fuzhou area. During the Warring States period, Han Chinese began referring to the modern Fukien area as Minyu suggesting that the native inhabitants of the area were a branch of the Yu peoples, a family of non-Han tribes who once inhabited most of southern China. In 306 BC, the Yu kingdom fell to the state of Chu. Han dynasty historian Sima Qian wrote that the surviving members of the Yu royal family fled south to what is now Fujian, where they settled alongside the native Yu people, joining Han and Yu culture to create Minyu. Their major center was not at Fuzhou's modern location, but further up the Min watershed near Yishan City. Qin and Han dynasties The first emperor of Qin unified ancient China in 221 BC and desired to bring the southern and southeast regions under Chinese rule. The Qin dynasty organized its territory in two commanderies, roughly equivalent to a province or prefecture, and the Fujian area was organized as Minjong Commandery. The area seems to have continued mostly independent of Chinese control for the next century. The Han dynasty followed the short-lived Qin, and Emperor Gaozhi of Han declared both Minyu and neighboring Nanyu to be autonomous vassal kingdoms. In 202 BC Emperor Gaozhi and Fofta leader named was Hu as king of Minyu, and a walled city called Yi was built. The founding of Yi in 202 BC has become the traditional founding date of the city of Fuzhou. In 110 BC, the armies of Emperor Wu of Han defeated the Minyu kingdom's armies during the Han Minyu War and annexed its territory and people into China. Many Minyu citizens were forcibly relocated into the Jiang Yian area, and the Yu ethnic group was mostly assimilated into the Chinese causing a sharp decline in Ye's inhabitants. The area was eventually reorganized as a county in 85 BC. Three Kingdoms to Sui Dynasty During the Three Kingdoms period, southeast China was nominally under the control of eastern Wu, and the Fuzhou area had a shipyard for the coastal and Yangtze River fleets. 
In 282, during the Jin Dynasty, two artificial lakes known simply as the East Lake and West Lake were constructed in Yi, as well as a canal system. The core of modern Fuzhou grew around these three water systems, though the East and West Lakes no longer exist. In 308, during the War of the Eight Princes at the end of the Jin Dynasty, the first large-scale migration of Han Chinese immigrants moved to the south and southeast of China began, followed by subsequent waves during later periods of warfare or natural disaster in the Chinese heartland. The administrative and economic center of the Fujian area began to shift to the Yi area during the Suai dynasty. Tang, Song, and Yuan dynasties in 725, the city was formally renamed Fuzhou. Throughout the mid-Tang dynasty, Fuzhou's economic and cultural institutions grew and developed. The later years of the Tang saw a number of political upheavals in the Chinese heartland, prompting another wave of Chinese to immigrate to the modern-day Fujian and Guangdong areas. In 879, a large part of the city was captured by the army of Huang Chao during their rebellion against the Tang government. In 893, the warlord brothers Wang Chao and Wang Shengji captured Fuzhou in a rebellion against the Tang dynasty, successfully gaining control of the entire Fujian province and eventually proclaiming their founding of an independent kingdom they called the Min. Kingdom in 909. The Wang brothers enticed more immigrants from the north, though their kingdom only survived until 945. In 978, Fuzhou was incorporated into the newly founded Song dynasty, though their control of the mountainous regions was tenuous. Fuzhou prospered during the Tang dynasty. Buddhism was quickly adopted by the citizens who quickly built many Buddhist temples in the area. The Walin Temple, founded in 964, is one of the oldest surviving wooden structures in China. New city walls were built in 282, 901, 905, and 974, so the city had many layers of walls, more so than the Chinese capital. Emperor Taizong of the Song Dynasty ordered the destruction of all the walls in Fuzhou in 978 but new walls were rebuilt later. The latest was built in 1371. During the Southern Song Dynasty, Fuzhou became more prosperous, many scholars came to live and work. Among them were Zhu Xi, the most celebrated Chinese philosopher after Confucius, and Xin Qiji, the greatest composer of the CI form of poetry. Marco Polo, an Italian guest of the Emperor Kublai, transcribed, after the conventions of Italian orthography, the place name as Fuja. This was not the local Ming pronunciation but that of the Mandarin administrative class. Ming Dynasty between 1405 and 1433 A fleet of the Ming Imperial Navy under Admiral Zheng He sailed from Fuzhou to the Indian Ocean seven times. On three occasions the fleet landed on the east coast of Africa. Before the last sailing, Zheng erected a stella dedicated to the goddess T and Fei near the seaport. The Ming government gave a monopoly over Philippine trade to Fuzhou, which at times was shared with Guangzhou. Galeota Pereira, a Portuguese soldier and trader, was taken prisoner during the pirate extermination campaign of 1549 and imprisoned in Fuzhou, later transferred to a form of internal exile elsewhere in the province. Pereira escaped to Langbaijiao in 1553. The record of his experiences in the Ming Empire, logged by the Jesuits at Goa in 1561, was the first non-clerical account of China to reach the West since Marco Polo. King Dynasty in 1839, Lin Zizu, who himself was a Fuzhou native, was appointed by the Daoguang Emperor to enforce the imperial ban on the opium trade in Canton. His unsuccessful actions, however, precipitated the disastrous First Opium War with Great Britain, and Lin, who had become a scapegoat for China's failure in war, was exiled to the northwestern section of the empire. The Treaty of Nanjing, which put an end to the conflict, made Fuzhou one of five Chinese treaty ports.
and it became completely open to Western merchants and missionaries. Fuzhou was one of the most important Protestant mission fields in China. On January 2, 1846, the first Protestant missionary, Rev. Stephen Johnson from ABC-FM, entered the city and soon set up the first missionary station there. ABC-FM was followed by the Methodist Episcopal Missionary Society that was led by Revs. M. C. White and J. D. Collins, who reached Fuzhou in early September 1847. The Church Missionary Society also arrived in the city in May 1850. These three Protestant agencies remained in Fuzhou until the Communist Revolution in China in the 1950s leaving a rich heritage in Fuzhou's Protestant culture. On August 23, 1884, the Battle of Fuzhou broke out between the French Far East Fleet and the Fujian Fleet of the Qing Dynasty. As the result, the Fujian Fleet, one of the four Chinese regional fleets, was destroyed completely in Mavai Harbor. Engravings and photos Republic of China On November 8, 1911, revolutionaries staged an uprising in Fuzhou. After an overnight street battle, the Qing army surrendered. Revolutionary Republic On November 22, 1933 Eugene Chen and the leaders of the National Revolutionary Army's 19th Army set up the short-lived People's Revolutionary Government of Republican China, blockaded by Chiang Kai-shek and left to twist in the wind by the nearby Soviet Republic of China. The PRGRC collapsed within two months. Japanese occupation with the outbreak of the Sino-Japanese War in 1937, hostilities commenced in Fujian province. Xiamen fell to a Japanese landing force on May 13, 1938. The fall of Amoy instantly threatened the security of Fuchao. On May 23, Japanese ships bombarded Meiwa, Huang Kai and Peiqiao while Japanese planes continued to harass the Chinese forces. Between May 31 and June 1, Chinese gunboats Fu Ning, Chen Ning and Su Ming defending the blockade line in the estuary of the Min River were successively bombed and sunk. Meanwhile, the Chinese ship Chu Tai berthed at Nantai was damaged. The Chinese Navy's Harbor Command School, Barracks, Shipyard, Hospital and Marine Barracks at Ma Wei were successively bombed. Fuzhou is recorded as having fallen to Japanese forces in 1938. The extent of Japanese command and control of the city of Fuzhou itself as opposed to the port at Mavai and the Min River estuary is uncertain. By 1941, the city is recorded as having returned to nationalist control. The British consulate in Fuzhou is noted as operational from 1941 to 1944 after the United Kingdom declaration of war on Japan in December 1941. Western visitors to Fuzhou in the period 1941 to 1944 include the Australian journalist Wilfred Burchett in 1942 and the British scientist Dr. Joseph Needham in May 1944. Both visitors recalled the presence of a British consul in a Fuzhou club comprising Western businessmen. In The Man Who Loved China, the fantastic story of the eccentric scientist who unlocked the mysteries of the Middle Kingdom, author Simon Winchester relates the visit of Dr. Needham in 1944. Needham encountered the American government agent and the British CIS agent involved in aid to the nationalist resistance to Japanese forces in Fujian province. As part of Operation Ichigo, the last large-scale Japanese offensive in China in World War II, the Japanese intended to isolate Fuzhou and the Fujian Province Corridor to nationalist forces in western China in the wartime capital of Chongqing. One account of the Japanese retaking of Fuzhou city itself is narrated by American naval officer Houghton Freeman. The date is given as October 5, 1944. Fuzhou remained under Japanese control until the surrender of Japan and its armed forces in China in September 1945. Following the restitution of republic control, the administration divisions of Fuzhou were annexed, and administration level was promoted from county level to city level officially. 
People's Republic on December 13, 1993, a raging fire swept through a textile factory in Fuzhou and claimed the lives of 60 workers. On October 2, 2005, floodwaters from Typhoon Longwang swept away a military school, killing at least 80 paramilitary officers. Geography Fuzhou is located in the northeast coast of Fujian Province, connects jointly northwards with Ninda and Nanping, southwards with Quanzhou and Pushan, westwards with Sanming respectively. Climate Fuzhou has a humid subtropical climate influenced by the East Asian monsoon. The summers are long, very hot and humid. The winters are short, mild and dry. In most years torrential rain occurs during the monsoon in the second half of May. Fuzhou is also liable to typhoons in late summer and early autumn. The monthly 24-hour average temperature ranges from 10.9 degrees Celsius in January to 28.9 degrees Celsius in July, while the annual mean is 19.84 degrees Celsius with monthly percent possible sunshine ranging from 24% in March to 54% in July. The city receives 1,607 hours of bright sunshine annually. Extremes since 1951 have ranged from minus 1.7 degrees Celsius on 29 December 1991 to 41.7 degrees Celsius on 26 July 2003. Administrative Divisions The administrative divisions of Fuzhou have been changed frequently throughout history. From 1983, the Fuzhou current administrative divisions were formed officially, namely, five districts and eight counties respectively. In 1990 and 1994, Fuqing and Changle counties were promoted to county-level cities. Despite these changes, the administrative image of five districts and eight counties is still held popularly among local residents. Fuzhou's entire area only covers 9.65% of Fujian province. The city of Fuzhou has direct jurisdiction over five districts, two county-level cities, and six counties. Culture The city of Banyans is distinct from the mainstream inland cultures of central China, and in details vary from other areas of the Chinese coast language and art besides Mandarin Chinese. The majority local residents of Fuzhou also speak Fuzhou dialect, a language that is considered to be the standard form of the Mindong dialect. Min Opera, also known as Fuzhou Drama, is one of the major operas in Fujian province. It enjoys popularity in the Fuzhou area and in neighboring parts of Fujian such as the northeast and northwest areas where the Fuzhou dialect is spoken, as well as in Taiwan and the Malay archipelago. It became a fixed opera in the early 20th century. There are more than 1,000 plays of Min Opera, most of which originate from folk tales, historical novels, or ancient legends including such traditional plays as Making, Seal, The Purple Jade Hairpin, and Switching Fairy Peach with Lichy. Religion The two traditional mainstream religions practiced in Fuzhou are Mahayana Buddhism and Taoism. Traditionally, many people practice both religions simultaneously. The city is also home to many Buddhist monasteries, Taoist temples and Buddhist monks. Apart from mainstream religions, a number of religious worship sites of various local religions are situated in the streets and lanes of Fuzhou. The origins of local religion can be dated back centuries. These diverse religions incorporated elements such as gods and doctrines from other religions and cultures, such as totem worship and traditional legends. For example, Monkey King originated to monkey worship among local ancients gradually came to embody the god of wealth in Fuzhou after the novel Journey to the West was issued in Ming Dynasty, as the most popular religion in the Min River Valley. The worship of Lady Lin Shui is viewed as one of the three most influential local religions in Fujian, the other two being the worship of Mazu and Bei Sheng Daddy. Local cuisine Fuzhou cuisine is most notably one of the four traditional cooking styles of Fujian cuisine, which in turn is one of the eight Chinese regional cuisines. 
dish is a light but flavorful, with particular emphasis on umami taste, known in Chinese cooking as zhanwei, as well as retaining the original flavor of the main ingredients instead of masking them. In fusel cuisine, the taste is light compared to that of some other Chinese cooking styles, and often have a mixed sweet and sour taste. Soup, served as an indispensable dish in meals, is cooked in various ways with local seasonal fresh vegetables and seafood. Distinctive snack foods are also an important part of fusel culture. Production of raw materials according to classification can be divided into many classes powder, starch, dry fruit, meat and seafood, etc., with rice, beans, and sugar as the main raw materials. Red and white rice cakes during the Chinese New Year, stuffed yuan shao during the Lantern Festival, zongzi during the Dragon Boat Festival, and sweet soybean powder covered plain yuan shao during the winter solstice are just some of the traditional foods enjoyed by the masses of Fuzhou. Special crafts bodiless lacquerware, paper umbrellas and horn combs are the three treasures of Fuzhou traditional arts. In addition, bodiless lacquerware, cork pictures and shush and stone sculptures are called three super excellences of Fuzhou.